Hello and welcome back to Shadows of Doubt. Oh no. Hold on. I'm just uh I'm just having a little bit of okay. I was I was a little bit worried there because I was like, wasn't I like starving and stuff? So like this must be an old save maybe. But we're gonna go get ourselves a bite to eat. I might just like grab something here. Is this something I can interact with? Oh, this is a news station. Let's go to a, a restaurant. I mean, I keep finding myself back at that one place uh, with the name I can't remember right now. Jade King. No, there's a there's a restaurant. You know, everyone knows your name. Indigo Hair. That's the one. Let's go here. We'll grab a bite. And uh, I, I need to clean myself up at some point. Talk to. Um, one of your opening hours. Could you provide fingerprints, spare change? What? Can you buy food here? What is inspect? That's not what I want at all. I want to. I want to buy some food. Can I like look look at the menu? Order. Here we go. Um, coffee. Get a cola. And a hot dog. Your inventory is full. Okay, well let's let's eat the drink the cola. Num 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 num. Delicious, hydrated. We've got lots of money. Uh, people been uh, hitting me with their their helpful tips in regards to uh, how to play this game, and I really appreciate it. Um, try to, I'm trying to stay relatively unspoiled. Um, I want to I want to be able to discover some things for myself. So I'm I'm kind of like tentatively reading things, but as soon as like tips get a little bit, you know, too useful, then I stop reading them. If that makes sense. All right. I wish there was a is there like a garbage can around here? My dude, do you live in 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 here in the indigo hair? Okay, let's uh let's take off. We're 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 nice and energized. Is that a garbage bin I can throw my stuff in? Nice. There we go. Okay, so we know that um, Kira Briant died. Wait, was it Kira Briant? Did she die or... No, sorry, Manuela de los Santos died of an entry wound of a, of a bladed blade attack. I thought it was maybe the sword, but... I don't know. It looks um, right now things kind of look like they're they're pointed at Kiara Bryant. She looks to be the killer in my opinion, and right now I'm gonna I'm gonna draw a loose connection. Could be. Continue. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, um, what we're gonna do next is we're gonna look at uh, we could look at cons consult hardware and rental. Um. Because I don't know if we can do anything with the black market. I don't know where the black market is. So we would have to find out where that is. Meet me at lunch. I miss you like ketchup. Uh, that's not going to be too helpful. Let's check out um, their work. Consult Hardware and Rental. Now we haven't met them yet. And as far as I know, they're not dead. Um, also, well, hold on. Business. Didn't they have a second work rota? This is, um, De Los Santos. De Los Santos says, uh, work rota. But didn't I have a second one? No. May as well, um, connect these things up. Just make, a basic connections here to make sure that I don't make that mistake again. Print it. What, what is this business card? Oh, yeah, this is something else entirely. Um, all right. Let's, let's make our way... Is this it here? It's the basement of uh, Stubbs. And always, we always come back to Stubbs, don't we? I know there's not a lot of buildings here, but is it that right there? Unknown address. Consult hardware and rental. We've got a camera, but it's pointed more or less away from me, so. 
if need be, I could potentially break into this place. Oh. Place isn't even locked. That uh, flickering is a little distressing, I will admit. Uh oh. Okay, there's a camera on. I'm gonna turn that off. Close the door. And. Is the camera looking right at me? Where is the security? There it is. It's locked. Lock picket. Breaker box open. Security door breaker, and what's the last one? Lights breaker. And we don't need to turn those off. Now we can turn the lights on. No problem. All right. We've got a, a little bit of time here. Here's our sales ledger. So what do we got here? Um, Patel, Butler, Savage, Yeboa, Sanders, Samuel, Jones, Nakagawa. Nothing too interesting here as far as I can tell. That light bulb is really annoying. Buckshot ammunition. Um, advertisement. I'm looking for... Well, we can look at the... The, the uh, safe, I suppose. Um... We're just... I'm doing a cursory glance for now. I don't think they sell weapons here of any kind, right? Like, what is what kind of stuff are we selling in this sales ledger? Pistol ammunition. I guess we do sell weapons here. Huh. Paxadol, badge, pistol ammunition, splint, rifle ammunition. I mean, the only thing that um, kind of cries out to me here is this combat knife. I'm not saying that this is anything of interest. I am just saying that uh, that's the only sale there with a combat knife. Um, let's see if we can do anything here. We have a limited amount of time before the camera starts up again. And then I'll have to turn it off again. Consult hardware. Okay, so we do have the password because we have uh, Brienne's password. So are the sales records here the same as the ones we just looked? Looks kind of like it. Yeah, combat knife. Patel, okay. Employee database. Let's check this out. Brient. Take that. What do we got? Type M. Well, look at that. Type M. Kier Brian. We've got a type. We've got type M fingerprints on the uh, on the sword. I mean, that's a that's a big old check mark right there. Hard to deny that. I don't think we had them on the sword though, didn't we? Okay. Inspect. Nothing, nothing here. What is this? Uh, I wonder what this pro... Oh, does that mean, like, that's how much I know about Kira, uh, Kira Briant? We have her fingerprint. We don't have their voice ID. I, don't, I wonder when that's going to become relevant. Height tall. Excuse me for a moment. Okay. Shoe size. We don't have their shoe size. Blood type. I wonder when that's going to be relevant. Handwriting. I have a very good salary. Sort of, I guess. Um, all right, so let's, um, back up out of this. Let's look at the mail. Reminder from Manuela de Santos. I think this is the same as their V-mail at home. I don't think that there's anything extra going on here. Reminder. Don't forget to pick up milk on your way home. Sun sync disc. 
yeah there's nothing interesting about this so um why don't we go ahead and look at uh surveillance i mean something oh okay let's uh let's turn off that camera again just gotta make sure wristwatch some money um here's here's what the thing right like we know vaguely when uh when the santos died so we could place uh we could place someone at the crime right we could um rule out for instance so we, th this requires a bit of organization here for me that i don't i'm not i'm not very good at this kind of thing uh, it appears that the victim has been slashed to death by the bladed weapon. I can determine the time of death is between 8.15 and 9.30 Tuesday. Uh, 8.15 and 9.30 Tuesday. So let's look at Tuesday. It looks like... What? Hold on, I'm, I'm a little bit confused as to what's happening here. Okay, who do we got here? Beth Gallagher. Don't I know Beth Gallagher? Isn't that the person that helped me uh, get my apartment? What's she doing here? At the Black Market Trader, huh? 9.30... 8.15... and 9.30... Well, unfortunately, we've got a big old gap here. We've got a big old gap between uh, 8.30 and 9.30. So, I, I don't know if that's good or bad, honestly. I guess that this is only... Um, is this... Like, does this only show me pictures, like when people were moving around, when there was anything of note. Unknown citizen. Oh, I guess we're operating... Hmm, hold on a second. Does this mean... No, yeah, it would say 8.15 or 9.30 p.m. It, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't say that if it was p.m. It would say something like, I guess, 2100 or something like that. Uh, what is 9 p.m. in military time? It would be, uh, 2100. I think I, I had that right, actually. So, um, but I guess it would be 2000 or, t t uh, I don't know how you want to put that. 21, 2000 hours in order to be 815. But either way, we have a, we have a big old blank spot between the, those two times. So, meaning, I, I don't think that there was anyone around. And then what do we, is there any, there's no other uh, cameras here. Which is interesting, because there is two cameras. You'd think that we would have two different angles at the very least. Let's have a look at Monday. Wait a minute. Um, worth noting also, Aaron Smith. Um, when is her work rota, Kira Briant? 6 o'clock to 8.30... Monday to Thursday. So worth noting here that her general work would be, uh, you know, would cover the hours that, uh, you know, would be basically um, coincide with the death of, of uh, the Santos, right? But as far as I can tell, she wasn't actually here. So that's Monday. It looks like we don't have Kira Briant here at all right now. I'm still, I'm kind of getting used to this um, interface a little bit. Yeah, it really seems like no one was here Tuesday um, between 6 and 9.30. So anyway, um, it doesn't really help us much, but uh, it does at least, um, you know, 
we we don't have a confirmation that it wasn't Kira Briant. So as far as I know, as far as I'm concerned, she's still the prime suspect. We kind of have a um a motive. It seemed to me that uh, uh oh. Okay, we're good. Uh, why don't we go ahead and get some fingerprints? May as well. Kira Briant, there's her fingerprint. Well, now, hold on a second. I thought these disappeared in 24 hours. That means she's been here 24 hours ago. Or, like, in the last 24 hours. Fingerprint on that screwdriver. That doesn't really tell us anything. We have a key. wonder what that key's for. For consult, hardware, and rental. Oh, we got a key for this place. What is this key for? For consult, hardware, and rental. They keep both keys in this, uh... In this display case. You're gonna have to, con um, forgive the, the noise. We've got a, um... We've got our, our air vent, which is good to know. In case I need to make a quick getaway. Let's uh, have a look through the trash. Square paper napkin that has been used and crumpled into a ball. Empty can of popular soft drink starch cola. Discarded packet of deep fried potato batons. Is it bat batons or batons, do you think? So, um... I don't think there's really much else to find here. We've got fingerprints of Kira Briant. You know, the one thing I'm a little bit um, distressed by is I don't, I haven't seen Kira Briant yet. She could be home right now. Several reports of them flirting with other employees. Strong character poses a distraction to the other staff. Always conversing about sports. Well, I mean, this is worth noting. We do have a, uh... Who is this? Aaron Smith. Too quiet. Will not progress with that effort. We have a motive. I think. Honestly, maybe not, but... Black Market Trader. This is the Black Market Trader record of Aaron Smith? We have their signature. Wait, why is this a different rec uh, record? K. Briant. That's interesting. Why? It seems to me we should have all of this information. Is K is it just because we don't have a confirmation that K. Briant is K. R. Briant? That seems like a bug to me. It should know full well that those two people are the same person. Fingerprint of Cabriant. Got a hairpin. Cabriant. I mean, there's. I really don't think there's much else to find out here. I'm being as thorough as I can, because why not? Aaron Smith, not really, uh, relevant. Wait a minute, what time is it? Tuesday? Shouldn't she be here now, I wonder? Commemorative baseball. Uh, the, the keypad should be easy enough. Yeah. Anything in here? We've got a diamond. A valuable gem. I wonder if I can take that and, like, sell it. Trophy. Decorative cup awarded as a prize. Perfume. 
bottle containing fragrant scent. Uh, I mean, like... Yeah, there's not much else to, to find out here. I really wish I would stop pressing that button by accident. I'm, I'm trying to press C. Um, coffee. Yeah, there's nothing else. I think, I think I'm good to leave here. That went pretty smoothly, though, I gotta say. Okay, um, so where is Kia Briant? That's the question, right? Um, what we can do is we can look up, you know, in a, uh, like, that should be public information, right? She, she lives where, uh, well, I suppose, hmm. It would tell me in, in the, uh, you know what? Let's just go to the, um, the indigo hair. It would tell us in the, in the public, um, directory, right? I'm pretty sure it would. I'm gonna guess that she lives in the same place as, uh, DeSantos. Okay. And B for Briant. K Briant. Location Stubbs Deluxe. I mean, we can just go there. There's, um, you know, not a 100% chance that she'll live in the 17th floor. I, I'm pretty sure that is the same place. I think, uh, I think I'm pretty much ready to hand this in, honestly. The only thing... Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, okay. Right, we gotta... Wait, what? That was weird. Um, the only thing left to do is... Do we have, uh, handcuffs? We do have handcuffs. Is I kind of wouldn't mind arresting her. Why is this not giving me the full list of, of floors? Oh, that's why. It's, yeah, I, I, I have encountered this in real life as well. Two different uh, elevators for, uh, you know, that have different access points. I do need to find Kiara Briant. I guess um, the only other thing is we could have checked in on Aaron. Um, just got some information on him. Like, got information from him, maybe? I, I think we can, like, answer all of these questions. The only thing we can't do right now is arrest Kira Briant because we don't know where she is. She could be anywhere. I mean, what happens to someone when their apartment is currently, uh, predisposed? Because the apartment is still under investigation. Well, it's not really. But, you know what I mean. Hmm. I suppose they should have gotten information on their, on their co-worker. How much I don't know how much money we get for arresting them an extra 350 it would be worth it What are the options here no Hmm I, I it feels really cut and dry to me. I really don't think that there's anything else like it like there's not really anything else that can follow up on even Yeah, let's just go hand this in. I'm gonna I'm gonna resolve it. I'm not gonna arrest Kira. I don't know where to find her. Kira Brian. Um, do you have evidence that places the killer at the crime scene? Now I did, like last time I did uh, fingerprints, but that didn't seem to work. Everything's flashing. I mean, her fingerprints. I'll try it. Where do they live? 
Um, now, this is interesting. How do I find their... Like, I never got uh, their address. I guess I can just put it in manually. Isn't it 1702 Stubbs Deluxe? Um... Where do they live? 1702... Well, whoops. 1702 Stubbs Deluxe. And have you located the murder weapon? I'm assuming it's that sword. It doesn't feel... correct. But, I mean, what else... It's just like, what else could it be, you know? Right? It's a big old sword right next to the, the, the body, you know? The only thing is, is that I don't think it had Kira Bryant's fingerprints on it is the only problem with this right now. Um, I guess, so someone mentioned that uh, there is like a security office in, in, in these buildings. So, like, if I wanted to be really thorough, like, there are all of these, like, cameras pointing everywhere. We could try and find uh, an actual, you know, picture or surveillance footage of Kira Bryant either leaving or entering the apartment around the time that uh, Del Santos died. So, like, if I wanted to be thorough, I could. But I guess I don't. Because I've got, I've got all of the information in hand. And in case... Let's see how we did. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Case processing. No. Wait, what? Unsolved. It wasn't Kira Brian? Please try again. Hmm. Isn't that interesting? I mean, I won't lie. Um, it didn't make sense to me. We didn't have fingerprints on the sword. But then again, I didn't really see any other fingerprints on the sword either. Okay. Okay. Let's try again. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm interested in this. There's no phone call to the place, or at least it's, it said that... Uh, okay, so we actually have a, a number and a location for Aaron, the co-worker. Let's go follow up on that. They live in my apartment building. 14th floor. I, I could try and find the footage um, around the time that uh, they died. Seems almost like a cheat code. Because in a way, like, if you can do that, why wouldn't you do that every time, right? I'm honestly amazed it wasn't Bria Re uh, Briant. Kira Briant. An, an interesting twist, honestly. We don't have a lot of leads right now. We don't have any leads, in fact. But uh, we can talk to Aaron. Maybe they know something. Seems to me they're not around either. Oh, hello. Evening, what's your name? None of your business. Could you could you give me your name? I'm Calbert Calbert Murphy, why? Do you know this person? None of your business. Um, do you know this person? Nothing to do with you. Fifty cents gone, I guess. Hundred. Mind your own business. Wow. 
Have you seen or heard anything unusual? Nothing. Mind your own business. Okay. Goodbye. Get lost. Oh, uh, okay. So I thought this, I mean, this is uh, Aaron's place. But we don't have, um, we don't, I, I can't find anyone, Jesus. Why is Lynn in bold? Different handwriting. Interesting. These were uh, people relevant to Briant, maybe? Oh, you know what? I bet you these, because we do have um, Briant's signature, right? This is uh, this is Briant's handwriting right here. So these um, are actually people who are relevant to De, De Santos. So why don't we go and follow up with one of their friends? I don't know. I'm not suggesting that they're the killer or anything like that, but we could go and talk to them at the very least. Gomez house. And I mean, uh, you know, barring nothing of this, nothing, nothing really happens of this. Um, why don't we, I could consider trying to find the security office of the Stubbs Deluxe. Although the Stubbs Deluxe seems to be a pretty posh um, building. And so I think reviewing the footage uh, would be difficult to say the least. Also, while we're at it, we have a sync disk here. We've we've got a, a you know a couple new sync disks, and they're taking up inventory space. We've got Spartan Insurance. Medical care is now covered. Reduced medical costs from involuntary hospital visits by fifty percent. Legal fees are now covered. You will no, not lose your, any stolen items you may possess upon involuntary hospital visits. Or Suffered from an accident that was not your fault. Covers medical costs and credits 100. Credits your account for it. Okay. Um, increased speed of lock picking by 50%. Increased efficiency of lock pick picking. Entering the lock picking stance on only no longer counts as an illegal action. Kind of like the idea of speed. I don't mind if the efficiency doesn't matter too much. I'm always pretty flush. And it doesn't look like an, I can upgrade that. And then we can do something here. Legal fees are now covered. Medical care is now covered. Reduced medical costs from involuntary hospital visits by 50%. That seems pretty good. Value up to 50, 500 credits. Yeah, let's take that. I, I, I feel like that's going to be good. We can also upgrade upgrade that. But um, why don't we leave it for now? We've got a sync disk upgrade vial still. I still have a sync disk um, in my mailbox to check out. I kind of would, you know, if I if I had a, a choice for a um, a sync disc or a cybernetic upgrade, I would love night vision in this game. Not having to turn on my flashlight would be amazing. I guess I was a little hasty on my initial guess with the uh, Kira Briant. Good to follow up on all of your leads before making a guess like that. It only costs a hundred, so it's not a big deal. I'm not too be bent out of shape about it. But um, Gomez has 11th floor landing. It doesn't tell me where they live though. Is it? Oh, okay, here we go. You gotta stop, it's bad for you. What? And that cola ain't. It's not what I'm saying. Hello. Evening, what's your name? 
As if I tell you, oh god, this again. 50 credits, none of your business. 100 credits, nothing to do with you, wow. Okay, well at least you don't give up the money when you uh, ask. Do you know this person? Sorry, that's personal. People are so resistant to tell you anything. Okay. Um, I want to know if they know... Well, we're, we're... The only person I want to know if they know is, um... Gomez. Not Gomez. <laughs> um... None of these people are really relevant. Why is Oni Johnson on here? All right, let's say Kira Briant. I saw them somewhere around Stubbs Deluxe. Um, could you provide your fingerprints for an investigation? Not giving you nothing. How about for... Oh, really? There's... I can't ask with money? 200 credits for your name? That doesn't seem worth it. Goodbye. Supremely unhelpful, actually. Just just telling me your name would go a long way, honestly. What? I mean, do I have a camera? Honestly, I wish I, I wouldn't mind just taking their picture. All right, let's see if I can find the security office of um, Stubbs Deluxe. I know where the telephone, like, operating room is, for the most part, but I don't know where the security room is. I don't even know if there's a camera on the same floor as, uh, you know... I'm, I'm forgetting everyone's name. Also, uh, Manuela Del Santos. Why don't I have her, I like, I have her work ID? Why don't I, like, have her as an identification? Queensworth Associates. You know, we could check in on this as well. And we're, it's in the um, Stubbs Deluxe, so we may as well, you know, kill a two, couple birds with one stone here. First things first, let's... Uh, let's have a look around here. So what is this? Unknown address. Unknown address. These are addresses. Consult and hardware and rental. Unknown address. And then this is uh, potentially security. Let's see how fast I... Oh. Don't even need to pick the lock. I would like to kill security, but it doesn't look like I'm going to have to because it's right there. Where, where's the security? Where does that go? Okay. I see the, the red line. Red line is connected to this. Okay. Wow, that's really fast now, actually. I I have no regrets on that uh, sync disk. That was this is really good now. Okay, so what do we got? Telephone router. Actually, we can turn the light on now. View call logs. Gomez is Gomez house. Is that's the that's a building though. Fourteen o two, fourteen o two. I all I care about is I guess there's seventeen o three. Um, I'm not seeing any telephone calls. Wait, from Stubbs Deluxe to Stubbs Deluxe, 103. I don't think 17, 1703 is not one I care about, right? 
It's to 103. So, um, I'll make a note of this. 1703 and 103 Deluxe. I don't think that this any of this matters. At all. But, you know, good to good to dot our I's and cross our T's. Sorry, let's have one more look at that. Stubbs Deluxe 103. And um, let's just, like, put these somewhere over here. Wait a minute. Yeah, 1703 is where everything is located. Everything is connected to 103 Stubbs Deluxe. Um, okay, so that is that is actually relevant information. Uh, so that, that came from Stubbs Deluxe to 103 Stubbs Deluxe. At 424. The problem is, I don't think that that's... Let's see. Oh, one... Oh, three, seven, nine. Okay. So that is, that's the same day, the exact same day, but, uh, that was like, f like much sooner in the morning than when, uh, Del Santos died. Still though, it's something, it's literally anything. So let's, uh, check out 103 Stubbs Deluxe. Just have a quick look in here for some uh, pins. No pins. No pins. Okay. Well, hey, um, here's here's an easy way of doing this. 103 Stubbs Deluxe. Who lives there? That would be Trisha. Trisha lives there. They are connected. That this is a contact of Kira Bryant, uh, Bryant, so that's worth noting right away. I want to make a, a mental note of this. I'm going to make a post-it note. Friend, uh, or sorry, connection. Sorry, known to Kiera. Called the morning of Manuela's death. We're getting somewhere. I don't know where we're getting, but we're getting somewhere. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I'll follow up on this, and then we'll probably end the episode there, just to see. Let's just go out this way. I guess I can go out the front, the, the up the stairs. Get the other elevator. One hundred and three Stubbs Deluxe. Someone is coming. Um, that my favorite is honestly when you go to find out about someone and they're not in the building, so you can like just kind of snoop around. Hello. Evening. What's your name? Keep your nose out of my business. Yeah, I'll give you money for your name. Hello, I'm Trisha Monday. Um. Do you know this person? Cost costs money to make money, I guess. Do you know this person? None of your business. We're gonna have to shell out for this. We still don't know. We don't have a contact for uh, Manuela, which is annoying. Kira Briant. Yeah, I know them. That's Kira Briant. Link to name, photo, fingerprints. They work at Consult Hardware and Rental. I saw them today at Fitzgerald Boulevard around 6.15 p.m. Oh, that's interesting. They were nearby Huyahana's Foods, <clears throat> headed west. 
Could you provide your fingerprints for an investigation? Hell no. Uh, have you heard anything unusual? Nothing. Can I come in and take a look around? I don't let people off the street into my home. Not even if I give you some money? Make it worth your while. Okay, I guess. Oh, nice. Let's uh, get some fingerprints. This is... Um, I don't even have a, a contact for this. Our pass is not going to last too long. What do we got here? Trisha Mande, em employment agreement, private and confidential. Rosemary Suds, employer, for the agreed amount of 15,000 cre 15, credits. Immediate dismissal, enhanced interrogation procedures, private cu custodial detention of an unspecified duration. Signed. I don't know if that uh, really tells us mu much. Maybe it does. An employment agreement. Uh, this is Anika Sharma. I think these are agreements that Trisha has signed. Oh no, Sharma uh, signed that one. Left eye power, 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 power. What? For Trisha Mande? Mande. Why? What is this about? Charlotte Heights Opticians. Oh. Please arrange an appointment in branch to see her selection of spectacles. Oh, this is just her, like... Um, you know, <laughs> the specs on her specs, if that makes sense. Drawn up between the landlord Emily P. P. Uh, Sick and tenant Anika Sharma. Not sure what that tells us. Tenancy agreement, Trisha Mande. Building maintenance reserve fund gym membership. Certificate of birth. There we go. There's something. For Tish, uh, and then uh, it seems to me that she lives with someone named Anika Sharma. I don't think that uh, that's going to be relevant, but well, maybe. Trisha, remember your passcode this time. Count up from five. Got to change this soon. These are specs. I think that was the person they live with. What's this? Tishamande work ID. Where does she work? Rosemary Suds. Makes sense. We have a work ID. We know what they look like. There's her purse. So, I mean, we're, we're finding lots uh, out about Tisha Mande. She could just be a colleague. Someone that, um, you know, was called the day of. Completely irrelevant information, honestly. You'd think that, um, oh, there's Kiara right there. 1703 Stubbs Deluxe. Not sure why you uh, turned the light out. Wonder how upset she's going to be if I use her computer. Seems to me she's cool with most anything right now. I think it's just five. No. 
Okay. I thought it was five. What's wh what does this note mean? Count up from five. Five, six, seven, eight. Profile. Okay, more information. Good stuff. V-mail. Sync disk, book grubs, flare quotes, pest control request. Anti-spore treatment, reminder from Anika Sharma, lunch date, nothing really interesting here. I feel like I've missed um, vital information somewhere. Something really obvious and easy. I might have to go back to the scene. Looks like she's sleeping. Fingerprints. It's always hard to get their fingerprints when they're sleeping. There we go. Take print. Okay. I'm, I'm assuming we got it. Fingerprint type P. We didn't get it? Type Q. Okay. So she's type Q, but where's type P? I guess that's going to be um, Tasha, whatever her name is. Hmm. Different passcode for the, uh, for the safe. Trisha. Um, well, we'll say not, not really getting much with this. Trisha Mende work Rhoda. Laundry worker. Like, we've got lots of information on Trisha, but I, uh, Trisha is seeming more and more regular and boring and not really relevant to anything. Anika Sharma, work Rhoda, wait staff. Should have made a note of the, you know, she, Trisha told us that she saw Briant, you know, going somewhere. Heading west. Soap. You know, this might be weird, but I honestly, oh, wait a minute. We got a knife. Not that that, we have knives in every apartment, right? Type P. Lots of type P's. We don't have a. Uh, we don't have anything on um, this other character. Videotape. How does one watch a videotape? Turn on. Yeah, sorry, I woke you. How does one watch a videotape? Hmm. All right. Uh, I think I'm going to leave. It's not really much of interest here as far as I can tell. I think before we fully call it, I'm going to head back to um, 1703 scene of the crime and maybe maybe i missed something maybe i missed something very obvious honestly at this point um like i, I think that this is a procedurally generated crime right uh i'm i'm open to uh speculation in in the comments 
I'm I I <laughs> I'm kind of uh amused at the the twist. I really did think it was Kira, but I didn't find any fingerprints on the sword. Honestly, I know this is going to sound weird, but I kind of certain some some things are leading me to believe that it was um self-inflicted. And I don't even know if that's a possible thing. Okay, let's see. Tobacco. Oh, I miss some money. Note. Remember your passcode this time. MD. Did I miss a bobby pin? I did. What's that? Business card. Cons consult. Consult hardware and rental. Cure a brand. We saw that. We saw these handcuffs. Birth control pills. I'm pretty sure we saw that. Videotape. I don't think I saw that. But I don't know how to play that. Oh, wait a minute. Is there a video player here? I wonder if I can just, like, videotape. Put it in this. Can I put it in the TV? Hmm. I don't know how to play uh, a videotape. Code breaker. That's my code breaker that I used already. Well, we have a videotape here. It might be uh, important. To be fair, I, I didn't really look into it. Got a diamond. I think I already took anything of value in here. Um, Manuela, Del Santos, business card. There's the sword. I didn't have what it takes. Pro promote me. They must earn my respect. See, like... Okay, listen, I know this is problematic, but I'm, I'm going to say it. All right? Maybe you're thinking it. I'm going to say it. This really actually genuinely looked like seppuku. <laughs> it did. It does. There's no fingerprints on the sword other than uh, the, the De Santos. De Los Santos. There's an email from De Los Santos saying that she's like sorry she let people down. Right? There's a there's a note saying they I didn't have what it takes. You know? A lot of things are leading me to believe that it was self-inflicted. What, what are the fingerprints on here? Type R? Yo, how come I never heard of a type R? New fingerprints on this type R. Okay, that's interesting. Let's, um pick up the sword and very closely in scan it, inspect it. Type N. Oh, belongs to Manuela de Del Santos. Right. So there's two fingerprints on it and they're both Del Santos. Um, inspect a vintage sword. And not much else to say about that. Drop it. Okay, well, I did miss something. Something important. There's a fi fingerprint on the on that business card. Fingerprint type R. I can't believe I missed that. I mean, I, I can believe I missed that. It, it was important. So, um, yeah, now we have something to follow up on. The problem is, is that like, you know, where, where are we going to find that blood, the blood on the walls? 
Did I look through the trash? Metal bucket, waste paper basket. I don't think I searched through this. Nothing, huh? Search, analyze, I already did this. Bullet wound, what? What? What do you mean? No. I've been slashed to death by a bladed weapon. W wait a minute, what? Ah, uh, am I missing something here? I have to I have to see that again a bullet wound Entry wound a bullet wound I thought it was a she died. I mean she she may have died from this from a slash Has been slashed to death by a bladed weapon So she was shot She was shot in addition to being slashed Well, that is a development my goodness. I was not seeing that curveball Well, whoever this type R is, um, they were very thorough. Like, I, I, the, the only place they left a fingerprint on was that business card. I feel like, uh, checking this entire place almost just to find one more fingerprint of this type R. It's very, very strange. So, okay. Hmm. They almost seem like... 100% like... Uh, it almost seemed like... Uh, Del Santos was assassinated. Like, I know that sounds extreme, but... I, uh, I'm, I'm kind of shocked... By some of the things I'm seeing. Dos Santos Fingerprint Dos Santos fingerprint What is this soap? Um, can I take a drink from the sink here? I can't tell if I'm drinking or not Tinned food. I'll take a tinned food. Bobbin hard cider. Gem stetter. Sure. Um, let's eat the tinned food. Well, I guess that's gonna do it for this episode. Um, uh oh. Yeah, I mean, that's a good place to stop. Um, I'm going to follow up on this. I guess the next thing I should do is uh, check the workplace of uh, Del Santos and see if I can't find someone who with matching fingerprints. I could also con try and find the security office of the Stubbs Deluxe, but I think that that's going to be harder in some ways. Um, y you have to imagine that that's going to be under lock and key. Of course, I'm not really seeing cameras on all of these floors, so I, I don't think that that's really going to do it. Um, like some of these have cameras. I guess I could check the 17th floor real quick and see uh, if they've got if there's a, if there's a camera on that floor. But yeah, uh, yeah. If you're enjoying this, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys uh, next time.
Let me just uh, get over here. Oh, there actually is a camera. Okay, well, good to know. Maybe we'll follow up on that later. Take it easy. I'll see you guys next time. Ta-ta.